A scary surprise for a Northwest Phoenix homeowner after finding an alligator in the front yard. The Herpetological Society called in to catch the two foot long reptile lying under the waterfall from a sprinkler. The alligator is believed to be somewhere between two and three years old and weighs a few pounds. Rescue crews caught the animal by draping a towel across its mouth. They believe that it chose to camp out in this particular lawn because, quote, he was probably attracted to the sprinkler. The society says in one month alone, they caught more than a dozen alligators. They say people buy them and keep them as pets, but once they get bigger, they release them out in the wild, and that can put someone's life in danger. These things can survive in Arizona weather. The heat in Arizona doesn't affect them in any way. The cold doesn't affect them in any way. These things are survivors. So now, you know, this thing let loose in a body of water manages to, you know, make it a, a home. And before you know it, it gets large enough that a small child, you know, goes to a lake or a river is chasing down some frogs or something and runs into this guy. And it doesn't take long before he can do a lot of damage. And before you know it, he can remove a finger, if not do more damage than that. Once an animal is taken from the wild, federal law does not allow the animal to be released back in the wild. So this alligator is going to remain at the Herpetological Society, where they'll use him for their educational programs.